It's time to make dinner, and tonight we had meatloaf, scalloped potatoes, and salad. And I'm going to show you what actually goes into making everything. I started out by making the ranch dressing. I used the seasoning packet from Aldi with one cup mayo, one cup milk. I do it in a mason jar. I shake it up, and then I refrigerate it till we're ready to use it. I chopped up one half of an onion, one half of a bell pepper. While I was chopping, I just cut up my garlic for my scalloped potatoes. And then I just put that in a little cup and I set it to the side. Here is my ground beef. This is a little more than a pound since it's just two of us. It's perfect. I kind of break up the meat a little bit and then I add the bell pepper and onion to it. I minced two cloves of garlic into it. I added some breadcrumbs. I only had these. I usually add panko, but I only had Italian breadcrumbs. I added a good pinch of salt and pepper and some paprika, some Worcestershire sauce, one egg, and then I put on a glove and I mixed it up really well till it was all combined. And then I put it in a loaf pan. I just kind of smushed it down uh, and made it level. And then I add uh, a squirt of ketchup on top and I spread it out. Uh, Ricky doesn't like the brown sugar glaze. That's why we don't do that. I went ahead and sliced up my potatoes using a mandolin. Now I sliced them super thin this time, thinner than I ever have. I got my cream mixture ready. I got two cups of heavy cream and my garlic into the saucepan. I heated it on the stove. I added a pinch of salt and pepper. And while that was heating up, I went ahead and layered my first layer of potatoes. And like I said, they're really thin. And then when my cream mixture was heated enough, I added the cheese, took cheese tacks. And then I added the rest of the cheese and whisked it until it was melted. So my cheese sauce was ready. And then um, I went ahead and poured half of it on my first layer of potatoes. And then I added the second layer of potatoes, which was basically just using what I had left. And then I put the other half of that cream cheese mixture on top. I made sure everything was covered. And then the meatloaf and the potatoes went in the oven at the same time for 45 minutes at 400. And then I went ahead and made us some salads. I like to put cucumber, carrots, tomatoes, cheese, uh, croutons, just a little bit of bacon bits. And then I went ahead and plated. I did the um, salads with the ranch dressing that I had made earlier. And then I plated up the meatloaf and then finally those yummy potatoes. And that was dinner for tonight. And now you have seen every step that goes into making dinner.